to half of people watches. As always, thank you for those who have liked and subscribed to my videos. I really appreciate it. Please keep liking the videos if you would like to see more watches. For today's episode, we have the oldest electronic digital watch in our collection with this Otron digital LED watch from around 1974. This was made by a company called Olympus Electronics. When this was new, digital watches like this had only been available for two years with the launch of Hamilton Pulsar in 1972, which was the first of its kind. Dad says he can remember LED watches from the mid-1970s and recalls that people were quite amazed by them at the time. These watches are the forerunners to the modern LCD watches that use a liquid crystal display whereas the first electronic digital watches had an LED display that used light emitting diodes. As these watches used so much power the display was not active all the time and so you had to press a button on the watch to see the time before it switched off again. Due to the power needed, this watch uses two batteries that are in a module that is marked as both Olympus Electronics Korea and also US components. I find it really interesting looking at the front of this module and how it differs from the usual LCD module. So let's take a closer look at the watch. The watch has quite a chunky, heavy gold plated stainless steel case. On the right hand side of the watch it has two buttons, one for the time and mode and the other countersunk to set the time and date. The face itself has a section of red tinted glass and through it you can just about see the LEDs under it. Pressing the side button once fires up the LEDs and presents the time illuminated in red numbers. You have to be quick though as they only stay on for about 2 seconds before turning off again. This is to save power as detailed earlier. Pressing the top button twice then displays the date showing the day and month. With this watch you can also view the seconds by pressing and holding down the button. This then shows the current minutes followed by the seconds. That stays illuminated for as long as you hold the button down. One thing about an LED watch is that they do not need any kind of backlight as the LEDs themselves shine up perfectly in the dark as we can see here. There isn't really anything else to say about the watch. It may seem very basic by today's standards but back in 1974 this really was quite technological marvel and for that reason it's worth just looking at it for a few seconds longer. And having another press of the button which seems to be quite infectious once you start pressing it. So there you have it, the 1974-ish Ultron Digital LED watch. I have to admit, I do really like this watch, although I think it would be cool if the display was always on. But then I guess that wasn't possible, as the batteries inside it would soon be dead. Thank you for watching and if you enjoy these videos and would like to see more watches, please hit the like key and perhaps even subscribe. You can see more of our watches at www.modestwatches.com and you can see my website at www.harveyp.com Thank you for watching, have a great day, stay safe, bye!